Good morning, my little cherubs. I'm glad to see you guys. Well, I'm glad to you guys are seeing me or something. Um, tomorrow will be our second to last Google Meets. So tomorrow we're gonna talk. Um, and that's the reason you have the, you're gonna finish the study guide and the quotes. So we can talk about those things. And then additionally, got a piece of hair sticking up there. Additionally, um, you wanna ask any questions you have about the one pager, okay? Cause I know there might be some confusion on that. Um, I know there was some confusion on the study guide questions that are due tomorrow. Uh, which is a group study guide for everybody. So everybody should answer, you know, some questions, but nobody should answer all of them. I know um, some people went a little crazy, answered a lot of questions. That's okay. Um, there is a section in there where each of you has to come up with your own question, and then um, you each of you has to respond to somebody else's question. So everybody should have a, an opportunity to do that. Basically, I just want you to cover everything that's in there, and I want you to know the information so that we can have a good discussion on, on Fault in Our Stars tomorrow. Um, and uh, then you have the one pager that's due Friday. There's no red, no, no red ink this week. <laughs> Um, and, um, yeah, that's it. Uh, last week, and I don't know if you saw the post last week, but, um, last week I decided that, um, I didn't want to give you all that work your last week, because I'm sure your other classes are loading on the work, um, and maybe giving you tests and all sorts of stuff, and, um, there's a lot of other things we can do for sure. I mean, I can give you, I mean, we can spend more, way more time on all the chapters and all of that, but I'm not giving a final. Um, I'm not going to give you guys an essay mostly because I don't want to grade it. Um, and I'm also, uh, I'm not going to give you a final fault in our stars test. Um, I think the one pager is going to be harder for those people who are a little bit less creative, but don't worry. It's not about creativity. It's about showing me that you know the novel. Um, all of the stuff that you have to write with it is going to take the place of an essay. And quite frankly, you're going to be writing, um, not as much as you would in an essay. You're going to be writing a lot more little things but it's going to really show me whether or not you read the novel um and um also even though it's creative it gives you a lot of freedom of what you want to put on there okay so um you see mine of oliver twist uh, even though you haven't read that book um but um i don't want to put mine a fault in the stars because i don't want you guys to mimic or uh, copy of mine, but you can see what the expectation is and you can ask questions uh, tomorrow. So the agenda for the week is no, no red ink. Your study guide and your quotes are due tomorrow. Today you're taking a Socrative over 10 through 23. It's already up and loaded. And then your one pager is due Friday. And then we have a Google Meets tomorrow and on Thursday. That's it. That's your final week with English 1-2 Honors with Miss Savela. And if you're switching next semester, then let me know. So I know if you're switching to a different class, you're going full remote or anything like that. Because um, if you are going full remote, you're, you're unfortunately, you're going to switch teachers. So, or fortunately, depending. Um, anyway, I hope you guys have a great Monday. I hope you're all safe and you had a great weekend. And I will see you tomorrow at the Google Meets. Bye, guys.